What's up guys, it's Craig with Alive Outside. Today I'm gonna to be doing a review on the Outdoor Vitals Zero Degree Summit Downfilled Sleeping Bag. This is arguably one of the best values on the market when it comes to a zero degree, high quality sleeping bag. Let's check it out. So this is the bag in its compressed state most of the way. It actually goes down to eight by 11 if you pull these tighter, but I wanted you to be able to see the whole thing. Uh, fits nicely into the base of a backpack. I have a Kelty Coyote 80, which is a pretty big backpack on its own, but uh, this fits real nicely right into the bottom of it. Weighs with the uh, compression sack only three pounds. So let's get it out of its pack and see how well this thing lofts up. So there's just no uh, second tie off right here to kind of knot this up. So what happens is when you go to take the top off to release it from its compression sack, the top actually comes all the way off. I prefer if there was something on here just to keep it. Not a big deal, not a deal breaker at all, but it's something I think could be improved on. All right, so it's only been about five minutes and you can see this thing is already starting to expand and find its own home. It will continue to expand. You leave this sit out for a half hour, an hour or so, and uh, it gets up pretty high, probably six or eight inches at least. Some of the earlier reviews that I had seen on this was that the fabric was very thin. Um, I think that's a good thing. It, it lowers the weight and this fabric is actually water resistant. So as I mentioned earlier, when down is not in use, you don't want to leave it in a compressed state. You want to take it out, let it loft up, let it remain efficient. That's, that's where the quality comes from. That's what keeps you warm. Um, when you're backpacking, you have it in a compression sack, that's fine. When you get to camp, you take it out, you let it loft up, you set it in your tent, your hammock, or wherever it is. That also holds true for when you're at home and you're not using it. Get it out of its compression sack and hang it up. This bag comes with two loops on the bottom to be hung. I hang mine in the closet and then just roll it up when I'm ready to go and head out. Now there's a lot of claims when it comes to temperature on sleeping bags. There's a comfort rating, there's a survival rating, and then there's just a general gray area where people call it a name and they put the temperature in the name, but it doesn't really get down to that. This Outdoor Vitals zero degree bag claims to be a zero degree bag. And I can tell you I've had it down to 12 degrees. I've slept in this maybe six or seven times so far, 12 degrees flat on the ground with just a Thermarest Z-Lite sleeping pad underneath me and it's kept me warm the entire night. I would think I'd have no problem bringing this down to zero degree Fahrenheit. It has a heavy duty YKK zipper that goes down about three quarters of the way. Gives you a lot of room to get in without any hassle. Up at the top, there's an extra layer here, which gives you a better seal around your neck and shoulders. There's a drawstring to pull it in tight and a Velcro strap at the end. So this bag actually comes in a long version, which fits people six feet to six six. It's six inches longer and three inches wider in the shoulders. I chose to go for the long option, uh, not because I'm tall, I'm actually six feet, I'm 210 pounds, but I like the comfort and I like the ability to store my clothes at the bottom of my sleeping bag when it's real cold, that way when I wake up, I'm not gonna be uh, having to put on freezing cold clothes. Now I'm all about hiking and backpacking and roughing it, sleeping on the ground, doing the whole thing, but I also like comfort. And one of the things I like most about this bag, it is very, very comfortable. The, the long version, as I mentioned, uh, comes six inches longer and three inches wider at the shoulders, but I'll show you um, how wide this thing actually gets across the shoulders. So you can see it's a lot wider than me and actually just doing this you can see the loft that's in this bag something to note again is the stitching on it it's good high quality stitching it's horizontal and vertical all the way through so the down doesn't have much room to shift around and you don't have many uh, weak thin spots to, to make it cold now one of the best points to make about this sleeping bag is not only its quality and its ability to actually take you down to zero degrees but it's only 180 dollars this bag, the, the quality of it, the 800 fill down, the amount of down that's in here, this is a $300 bag all day long. And the way Outdoor Vitals is able to do that and sell it to you so inexpensively is they're a direct to consumer company. So they cut out the middleman, they cut out the markup and you buy directly from them. 
I had this thing shipped to me. It came in a couple days. No issues with shipping, no issues with quality. Uh, like I said, I've had it out five or six times already this winter and uh, it served me very, very well. Now, the only thing I wish there was an option of was the color. There's two color choices as of right now online. There is a green, uh, which is a very bright fluorescent green, and then there's a dark green. This is the dark green. Um, I prefer to be very subtle when I camp and when I'm hiking. I don't want to be seen. I don't want to be spotted. I like olive drab. Um, I like brown. I like black. I like it to blend in with the atmosphere. Um, so if there were more color options, I think that would be better. But the solution to that is just put this in a bivy bag. So I'll put the link to Outdoor Vitals below in the description. You can find out more info on the bag, all the detailed specs you need. You can write to them for questions, place an order, whatever you need to do. Um, I got mine in just a couple days when I, once I ordered it. Came in, no issues. Quality is outstanding. Shipping service was fine. Overall, an excellent bag that I would highly recommend. This is, again, like I said at the beginning of the video, arguably the best value for a zero degree winter sleeping bag on the market. So thanks for checking out Alive Outside. Make sure you subscribe for more product reviews, hiking and backpacking trips, overall outdoor adventures that John and I get into. If you have any questions or comments, just leave them below. Thanks and be well.